Flushing a better flushing, and we need to vote for Danny Chen. He's the right man for this for this area. We need someone that's honest, hardworking, and perseveres for everyone here in Flushing. Please stop the voter fraud. Please, as we people, call your board of elections every single year and make sure you're registered and you're being registered under the party that you want to vote for. And make sure you don't have any absentee ballots. Again, please check your status at the board of elections every year. And please vote for Daddy Chen. He's the right man for the job. Welcome through the documents on there. Okay. Okay. Now I'm going to show you some documents. I don't know if you're going to be able to see them. I don't know if you're going to be able to see them, but this is the fraudulent absentee ballot. My husband's, Peter Rubino, and mine, Deborah Rubino. Our signatures, fraud. And my mother, Pilar Perez, and that's it. Pilar Perez, my mother, Peter Rubino, my husband, and Deborah Rubino. These were the absentee ballots that were sent, and the signatures are totally fraud. And if you look at our original signatures, you can tell 
Yeah. That's not a signature. Yeah, and then you please make sure you vote and make sure you check the status and vote right, for the right people and the right person. Because she needs it, the world needs it. Get involved. Hi, my name is Alex. A, of, a few months before the actual election, uh, several people from Mr. Petty's campaign came to my house with uh, a clipboard and papers on it that said a survey. Uh, he asked me to sign it. Uh, I was a little bit reluctant to sign signing it, but it, did, it looked pretty innocent. When I went to vote on June 27th at PS 163, which is two blocks away from my house, I was also a poll worker for the Board of Elections at that school. Um, I was one of the first ones to vote that day. And surprisingly, when I went to vote, it came up in big red letters, absentee ballot. So everybody thought this was unusual, including myself, because I never in my life voted with an absentee ballot. Why should I? I live two blocks away, and I'm a poll worker at that school. So I thought this was highly unusual. Several other people that day uh, voted, and their names came up as the ballot, and they were quite furious. I complained to the supervisor over there and several other people on the Board of Elections. Nobody really did anything, and that was the end of it. Um, I got a copy of the actual affidavit ballot that I filled out, which is what you, uh, you fill out when you can't vote at the election. So I filled it out, name, address, phone number, signature, social security number, and I sent it in. I also got a copy of supposedly was the absentee ballot that they claim I filled out. And if you notice something here is a signature. That is not my signature. That is for somebody else signed for. This is a copy of the absentee ballot again. It's my signature, which it is. It's a fraud, and so is the um, the printly signed. So this is a copy of the affidavit ballot that was sent to the board. So basically, this is a case of fraud, and these are raw affidavits that sell for the So all I can say is, I think you should vote for Danny Chen in the upcoming election. He is the honest candidate, and he's the best person to represent this district in Flushing. Thank you. Mr. 
the dunk. Come. Excuse me, what is this clip for? Those are affidavits. <laughs> and how many are there? 70. These 70 people that said they did not vote absentee and they signed and witnessed. Thank you. I appreciate that.感谢神啊这个替我们安排的啊今天是地球下的个秋雨之福给我谢谢啊大家来参加的都享受这个秋雨之福更得到这个秋雨之福但是呢在这个啊我们这个美丽的社会里面在这个best法拉盛啊未来
，哦，这里完全的哦显示出来，啊、哦，你最终是不是这里，啊、哦，这一次这个这个啊、哦，我们只能说候选人作弊、欺骗，啊、哦，所以我们用啊、哦、这个不诚实。好，不诚实来解说。好，感谢各位啊！今天我们大家只认识这个投票的事实、投票的分析结果啊。我们是希望在年底大选的时候，好，今天来参加的这一些 complain 的啊，这些人啊，我们也感谢他啊，众多的 complain 到了选务局那里，所以选务局这一次非常的配合。啊、哦，法官、法院的啊、哦、要求，把所有的证据、所有的一切都公布啊、哦，再公布于事实啊、哦，这是一个民主的国家，我们谢谢民主，民主就是和平公正啊、哦。今后我们希望在年底大选的时候，我们要选一个真正帮老百姓服务做事的啊啊、哦哦，帮老百姓为民喉舌。在纽约市政府在市议会上面争取法拉盛的建设，法拉盛本来就是一个美好的地方，也是一个未来在全美国最有前途的一个创，最有前途啊，建设起来啊，商业繁荣，人民富庶啊，感谢各位，谢谢各位，谢谢。杨哥，杨哥自己讲。什么事情？杨哥，你讲你在选民权利去支持的国的本质呀。So here we are again in the house where you will come. Both of you all have the reason why we're here protesting. There's three crimes that have been committed. You have forgery. You have ID theft. And you have ballot harvesting. Illegal. Ballot harvesting by a mail-in ballot. This is an outrage. We people need to stand up in our community. So many things has improved because we have stand together. We must continue to stand together and fight this abomination of erosion, erosion of our rights. We must fight together. United we stand, divided we fall. Even we stand, let's get together. Let's fight for this. Fight. It's the only way. That's the only way. That's how everything got won in this country. Because the squeaky wheel gets oiled. <laughs> so let's squeak, people. Let's do a lot of squeaking. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Now I invite you any chance to do his own talking and reading. Of whatever has happened to him and the horrible struggle that he's gone through in order to fight for this community. The right to vote is the primary right by which other rights are protected. If we lost the right to vote, we lost everything. We cannot afford that. We the people, we have right to say, I am among of you. The story that the vote got stolen is happened to me. It would happen to New York. It would happen to everywhere in this country. We know this is just a start. It happens 2020. It happens 2027, 2023. If it happens later, we don't know. What city, what town? If we don't fight, we lose. If we don't fight, nothing going to change. So, for this election, I know it happens. Stolen my people's vote to me. It happens. Judge, maybe I'm fair. It happens. Your people, maybe betray you. It happens. But in our heart, nothing can hurt us. If you, you and me, everyone stand together, stand bold, dream bigger, do it for this country, do it for our people. Don't 
us what this country do for us. But us, what can we do for our country? I had a dream. Let my people vote. Simply and easy. Why? People cannot vote. Who said it? The power one? The media one? No. Everything is corrupted in this country. From top to tail. What we should do? Don't give up. Don't give in. It's time to act together. It's time to fight together. I personal cannot achieve it by myself. I need your help. I need you stand up. I need the voice of people. Shout out. I need the people's angry expression. We are people. We are people. We are people. Wake up. Stolen. The world is stolen. What we should do? We form a coalition to fight for our rights. There's no rights is free. Every rights comes with an effort. You go to fight. No freedom is free. So we not sit back. We will keep going forward. We will keep fighting for a better country, a better New York, a better Russia. Please support me. Move for me on November 7. We the people, we marching out for the justice. We say no to the injustice. We say no to lost unfair election. It is your turn to spread the news out to the people know this stolen, this election was stolen. Let me show you. There are 100 people here. Volunteers, volunteers go every day to get their affidavit to sign. They know the vote is not their vote. It's dishonest. It's dishonest. It's just that dishonest. Those 100 people, they be for your family, your you family, Alex. Those are seniors. They cannot wait. The COVID-19, hold them three years, cannot wait, cannot vote. Now, they come out, but they cannot vote. Their vote was still. Who steal them? Who steal them? Stand up. Board you of election. Do. Board of elections. Board of elections. Do your job. They corrupt. Do your job. They corrupt. Why? We have to wonder what happened. Did you check the signatures before you put turn them to the ballot? It's dishonest. It's dishonest. It's dishonest. Okay. It's. It's shame. It's shame. Because it is, because it is election law. The court, court dismissed 40 hours before the court date. Why? What they are afraid of? What they are afraid of? What they are trying to hide? No way. We the people, we are going to discover it. If we don't do it, they will continue to do it forever. So, where is our future? Where is our hope? Where is my people? Where is my family's future? Where is my kids' future? Where is your kids' future? Our future hang on balance because of absentee ballots. They're easy to vote. So, my dream is to let my people vote. Don't stop our people's signature. The signature is so vital to every people, every life, every right. Who they are to stole it? This injustice. We will fight until the end. November 7, please vote for Danny Chen. Vote for Danny Chen is a vote Danny for safety. Yes. Thank you so much. Okay. And please, please welcome Danny for New York. Danny, Danny for New York, my website. Okay. Okay. Thank you.
Thank you. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Josephine Aronson. I am not running until this is cleaned up. I am a part of a team called New York Citizen Audit. We will not wait for the politicians. The citizens from upstate New York went to the Board of Elections, did not get any information, which is public records. So we went to court and we got a fire, a, a, fire, a, a, a Freedom of Information Act order and they gave us all the information, okay? When the citizens went into the Board of Elections, they found out per borough how exactly the discrepancies. 12-year-olds are voting. 130-year-olds are voting. One registration can bring out five different people to vote. The dead are voting. The criminals are voting. The undocumented are voting. If the Board of Elections cannot control you, they will sabotage your election. Half of the people in office cannot prove that they won. The citizens did not wait for the politicians. The citizens did it. If you go under auditnewyork.com, you'll see exactly how they've been doing it for decades. This is not the first time and it's getting worse because they're narcissists. So what happens when they cheat? They select and they don't elect. That's why you have your sociopaths in office. That's why you have your pedophiles like Anthony Weiner in office. That's why you have 800,000 children missing in the United States because these six sociopaths want to destroy your life. They don't want patriots. They don't want hardworking people. There's a lot of people that are not politicians, but they just see how the state is being destroyed from the inside. There's a lot of good people that are running that never been politicians. Retired NYPD, veterans, teachers, okay? They cannot win because they can't be controlled. If they can control you, then you win. Ladies and gentlemen, you gotta get involved. This is for your children. This is it. If you don't get involved and you stay home to watch Netflix and eat your heart out, you're a traitor. You have to get involved. They wanna destroy your life, your home. They wanna take your property away. They wanna document your, document your children. They wanna destroy the Board of uh, 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 Education and talk about a man is a woman and a woman is a man. It is so sick. New York is the first state that was willing to abort a nine-month-old baby. They were the first ones. New York loves drag queens in your schools. New York is the spearhead of destroying your property, of congested pricing to steal more of your money. They want to destroy the New York. This is the last. This is it. So I want to encourage you, go under New York Citizen Audit. These are the citizens that discovered exactly what they're doing because the people are not counting your votes. The algorithms in the software is what's choosing your candidates. So please get involved. This is it, okay? If you don't get involved, CCP will be here and take over New York. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. They already had a Chinese police station here in New York. Did you know that? Times Square? Did you know that? Yeah. Lots of crap is going on. stole my signature and fraud vote for me. Vote for myself, not for the thirty thousand. Nobody does. That's why we're here. Lots of, lots of, lots of. It is a shame, but it is a way to make this for you. Everyone has the proof. We have boxes and boxes of proof of all the robbery that took place with the voter fraud.
What right does the judge have to just throw out the case without looking at the proof? Without looking at the evidence? This is corruption at the highest. That you can't go to court, you can't even get justice. That's uh, everyone come here to take a picture, okay? Okay, 被淹沒了聲音被人當成草芥所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你所以請你
We will let God reign, God and government. 所有的权利来自于上帝，上帝才是 our big boss. God is our big boss, not government, not people, not officials. God is our big boss. 上帝才是我们最大的老板。所以每个人一起来，来实现我们的梦想。Let our people go. Let our people can be a voter, change our community. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. 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 Thank you so much. Okay, 谢谢谢谢。你们的票可能都被偷了，你们十一月七号投不了票，怎么办？打这个电话，选举局电话，七一八七三零六七三零，把你们的票解开。你说我不要 absent b a l l 我不要缺席投票，我要自己投票。OK， 我去，我有手有脚，我可以自己投票，好不好 ？OK， 谢谢你们。Hi, Mr. Trump. I hope everybody here understands what's happened, and I hope everybody here supports your neighbors who have been denied the right to vote. Anybody comes around and asking you to sign something, make sure you read it and understand it. Because they're out there to steal your vote. We don't want people's votes stolen. This is America. You are a citizen. You have a right to vote, and your voice needs to be heard. And nobody has the right to take that away from you. By hook or crook, they don't want this candidate here in office for a reason. Because of what he stands for. I've known Danny. I totally respect him. He's an asset to your community, and he'd be an asset to New York City Council as your councilman. So I hope you work with your fellow neighbors and make sure they come and they report every vote that was denied. Because the only way this is going to get corrected is by people speaking up and standing up for your rights and for your neighbors' rights who were denied the ability to vote. So stay together, stay united. And support what's right, because our city council needs it dearly, and Danny's the guy to do it for you. My name is Edward Manfredonia. I was wired by the FBI. Fran Townsend, Bush's advisor on Homeland Security, wired me. If you don't believe me, here's a copy of the wire order on the back of my shirt. The Democrats, the drug smugglers, got men on Wall Street. My friends smuggled drugs into the United States. They allowed the shower posse. To smuggle drugs and to murder 1,400 African Americans. All the drugs that come into this country, 80s, 90s, up to 2010, the FBI allowed to come in. They have me on a wire. They have letters from me to FBI agent Joseph Yastremski. I met with、uh, in 2012 with FBI agent、uh, I forget his name now, Zukowskis. He told me to forget about the drug smuggling by the FBI. The FBI allowed. Cal Strom gave copies of my documents to the, to the drug smugglers, and I am not kidding. It isn't China smuggling drugs; it's white guys on Wall Street, and one of them owns a baseball team. He was a partner in Goldman Sachs. Thank you very much. My name is Aaron Fuldenauer. I'm Danny Chen's lawyer. We're here today to fight injustice in the Republican primary that was held on June 27th. We have compelling evidence that the James Pye campaign submitted hundreds and hundreds of fraudulent absentee ballots in this election, and we're here to fight for justice. Today. We're not really starting yet, are we? Yeah. 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 Okay. Great. We have compelling evidence that seven individuals connected with the James Pye campaign engaged in widespread election fraud, submitting fake absentee ballots. We're here to stand up for justice and integrity in our elections. There's nothing more important than that.